My name is Melvin and I'm an associate publisher and forum moderator for the Hair Transplant Network. And in this video, we're going to be discussing whether you should shave your head first before having a hair transplant. But before we get started, if you guys are interested in having a hair transplant or you want to research a surgeon, I'm going to go ahead and link the Hair Restoration Network discussion forum in the description box, guys. It's free to use. There's real reviews, real patients. You can message them and get their unbiased opinion. You see the good, the bad, and the ugly. So educate yourself. All right, now let's get started. All right, you guys are probably thinking, Melvin, we already know what you're going to say. It's in the name, Hair Transplant Network. But you guys are wrong. Yes, you should definitely shave your head. Anybody who's losing their hair, shave your head. And I'm gonna get into the reason why. All right, so first and foremost, here at the Hair Transplant Network, we're patient advocates. We don't sell hair transplants. We will never pressure anyone into having a hair transplant, try to convince them to have a hair transplant, and most importantly, we will never charge a consultation fee to review anybody's hair loss photos to tell them what we think. That's crazy. There's people actually on YouTube doing that. If you're considering paying some guy who's had one hair transplant money to look at your photos, please, please, please do me a favor. Go on the Hair Restoration Network discussion forum. You'll get all of the information you need for free. All right, now let's get into the reason why I think that anybody who's having a hair transplant should shave their head at least once before they have the procedure. Okay, so the reason why I think anybody who's considering having a hair transplant should shave their head at least once is because shaving your head has no drawbacks. There's really no risk involved with shaving your head. Um, besides you looking a little bit worse or not looking as good without hair, but at least you know, at least you know that for sure you want to have a hair transplant. You want to take that risk. You want to do the research. You want to spend the money, the time, and all of that, your resources on regaining your hair. Um, the reason why I say this, guys, is because not everybody's the same. Some guys, and I've ran across so many guys on the forum who shave their head and then they realize, you know what? Why the hell did I spend money on a hair transplant? I look good with a shaved head. I should have just shaved my head a long time ago. Believe me, there's guys out there that are like that. And these guys typically go back and say, how do I undo the hair transplant? How do I get rid of these scars? How do I just go from, you know, having to, you know, mask my hair to just living as a bald guy? Unfortunately, once you undergo a hair transplant, you can't undo it. There's no undoing a hair transplant, so forget about it. That's why you should shave your head first because who knows, maybe you'll like it. Um, I tried it. I shaved my head for a year before I decided to have a hair transplant. I hated it. I mean, every time I would look in the mirror, I was like, who the hell is this guy? I don't know who this guy is. I had a little tiny little peanut head. It was just not good. I had a little pin head. I looked ridiculous. Uh, my facial features just don't match a, a shaved head. Um, but everybody's different. You guys, you guys may like it. You know, I remember when I was losing my hair, everybody was like, yeah, just work out, grow a beard, shave your head. And I bought into it, I did it, and <laughs> no, not for me. So I, under, I, I started researching hair transplant surgery, and I've had three, and I've never looked back, and I've never been happier than today. Um, if you're considering it, try it out. Shave your head, maybe you might like it. And if you do like it, you don't have to spend money. And there's no risk, no scarring, no downtime. All right, in closing guys, if you guys found this video informative or you guys liked it, I would really appreciate it if you guys give me a like. And if you think anybody would benefit from this video, go ahead and share it with them. And if you guys like the content that I, that I put out on this channel, and truly, I hope you guys do like it because my goal is just to educate you guys, give you guys all the knowledge that I gained from going on the forum and having three hair transplants and just give it to you guys for free. There's guys out here charging money, thousands of dollars for consultations, which is crazy. Don't ever do that, okay? That's why this channel exists. So you guys get this information for free, all right? Till next time.